late Joshua's elder brother Gideon Kowaru fondly recalls playing side by side with him from their humble beginnings with the Kumuls touring the world. Myself, Alda, and Joshua, we started playing. We were starting playing a couple of scary scary Okay, people are walking about the Nabis Kam Kam, come up the down. Saturday rest, Sunday play, and Monday morning walk back again. Reflecting on Joshua's legacy, Gulf ISO team manager Raymond Aru, cousin Abel Koivi, and former teammate Tuxi Karu share cherished memories of their time with him. I have um, tried my best to emulate, emulate what my uncles have done. Not in, in the field of rugby league, not in playing, but in terms of administration. I know my uh, late Bubu, he has been very strong in that field. And you know, it's been a, a passion for, for me to, to, to follow their footsteps. Uncle Joshua has been a big part of that. So we took the lead in, in, in our family in playing for West. The beginning of West up until they came in, and uh, they came in and took our place. We decided maybe after we got married, we had children, we had other responsibilities. So, and uh, some of us decided that okay, the younger ones take on, and that's where the core brothers came on. So we come inside the West Club and we come, we play the third grade. One year the third grade, that's all, we go on tableau. Promoting me go on tableau, eight grade. That's how we play one time. Play brother of them. We love play. 91, we love to have one time. Uh, first, uh, 1990, we love to have Queensland tour. The rugby community mourns the loss of a true icon. James Gooken, Pukai Sports.